Greetings and welcome. This will be an X Plane 10 stream. Uh, it will also be a YouTube video. And today's video is on X Plane 10 with Ramesses B777. Sorry. It's Ramesses B777 World Airliner. And I'm going to show you how to load a flight plan into the FMC. But this isn't typing it in waypoint by waypoint this is actually loading it from a flight planner one of the tips I've picked up um, how to get the, the flight plan into the FMC so it's not straightforward I use a program called flight sim commander here we go um, now uh, we're actually at we're at a different airport, we're at Munich at the moment in X plane. So I'm gonna do a quick flight, just plan a quick flight from so I just use it's I'm not gonna plan it properly or do anything. I'm literally you got two route finders here. I'm gonna use the route finder one because I find it easier. So we're going from EDDM to I'm actually going to put Gatwick. I'm not going to fly it. I'm just going to show you how it, how it's done. So we click Find Route. Down here it's loading. So there it go. It comes up with our route. I'm not really going to show you how to plan a route in F in this Flight Sim Commander because um, you may have a different one, different flight planner. Um, so you put your, you put together your flight plan. So so I've got a, a list of points here. Um, Munich up to input and then on a uh, airway up to Upal UL610 to Batty UL608 to Dennett UL610 to Koppel and then it's a standard turn arrival into Gatwick so we OK that just so that it plans the route in, in our flight planner so we've got all the points now all loaded in this is with all the stops in the airways so as you can see there's quite a quite a lot that would take quite a bit of time now here's the good bit depending on your flight planner you need to set um, the output path in in flight sim commander it's actually gonna be well for any of your flight planners it's actually the aerosoft X the extended that will output into an FLP file which is what we need if we go I'm gonna bring you up bear with me a moment so let me cancel that come back to my X plane 10 this is my X plane 10 folder in aircraft heavy metal wild airliner uh, plugins, avionics, routes. This is where it saves your flight plan, your FLP files, your flight plans. So it's it's aircraft, heavy metal, 777 world airliner, plugins, T7 avionics, routes. That's the f that's the folder you need. Okay, that's in your X plane folder. That is going to be your export directory for your flight planner and the Aerosoft Airbus so in in flight sim commander under paths here the Aerosoft Airbus I have actually set it to export to games basically my the folder we just talked about aircraft heavy metal 777 world airliners plugins T7 avionics routes so now one last step we need to do it won't load into the FMC unless we put zero one on the end of the flight plan so here where it's going to save the file name by default it would just put EDDM EGKK we need to add a zero one on the end for the FMC to accept it now when we click save I've clicked save there I go back to my roots folder we now have here an EDDM EGG, 
egkko1.flp file created today moments ago so and that's in our roots folder so if we go back to xplane done a bit of cheating today let me talk oh, it's a bit loud let me turn that down um, Turn it down a little bit, it's very, very loud, sorry. Um, so now in X Plane cheated because I've just done load the load the aeroplane all started up. And all I'm gonna do as you can see we're sitting at Munich. I'm not not particularly set up to go anywhere, but bring up your FMC. Now if we go into the FMS, we still need to do the, the first couple of steps. We still need to set our reference airport, which is obviously Munich. Uh, actually, the inertial, the, the set inertial position is set, so the GPS knows where we are. Yeah, it's picked it all up. So, in route. Now, this is the good stuff. We can do. You can either do route request, and that's going to show you your route folder. So we've got here eddm egkk 01flp We can click on that, and there we go. We can go to the next next page. We have got all of our waypoints. Now that's only the waypoints for the flight plan. So if we activate and execute, that is it. That is your flight plan loaded into your FMC. Pretty much. That will fly a basic flight plan. Obviously there's any of you who know how to fly realize you've probably got to go through the departures and arrivals but that then requires knowing <coughs> the departure winds departure runway calling up ATS, ATIS and ATC to find out all that information and obviously plugging it in um, I don't know Munich particularly well I haven't done any research on what the SIDs are standard instru instrument departures are um, but obviously if it, we could we, we would go on and select the rest of the details that's all I'm going to show you in this video thanks for watching I hope it's been helpful uh, the next video I'm not sure if you've got any requests please put them in the comments below cheers bye